Echinacea purpurea is commonly called the purple coneflower. However, that's a bit of a misnomer because today, with modern cultivars, you can get many colours, including white. It's also said to grow well in full sun. However, as you can see, ours are growing happily tucked away in the garden border beneath some salvias. Echinacea purpurea is said to have medicinal benefits in that it's said that it fights infection. However, we like it as a garden plant where the flowers that appear in late summer seem to last right through the season. Care is fairly easy. Simply deadhead after flowering because when you remove the spent flowers you'll promote more flowers. Then, in late winter, you can cut the plant right back to the ground. With many colourful cultivars available, you can find an Echinacea purpurea variety to suit almost any colour scheme in the garden. They're reasonably tall growing, and we think that they're a very easy care plant. Plant them in a humus rich, deep soil, provide a little bit of extra water, although they are reasonably drought tolerant, and for performance, a little fertiliser. You can use some liquid seaweed fertiliser through the season and a general purpose slow release fertiliser in early spring. Echinacea purpurea. More than purple, there's whites, there's pinks and there are also double flowering varieties as well. If you'd like to know more about Echinacea varieties and where you can buy them, visit the website. If you'd like to know more about autumn flowering plants, including pansies, salvias, nasturtiums and many more, then subscribe to the YouTube channel.